holla at your girl happy monday guys happy afternoon and happy memorial day and mostly important happy new moon energy baby guess what also happy um rosh hashanah this is year five seven eight two guys this is the year for a return this is the year for the increase seven increase fold i just saw a ministry last night there uh that this is seven increase fold i'm right on time with my 16 26 on clock one plus six is seven baby i'm tapped in i'm locked in such a god three two three i love you guys thanks for being like subscribing and share red and if you get a chance hit the notification button down below so you're notified when i post my videos okay guys so happy monday um it seems like there's like not traditional cookouts for memorial day so i'm just gonna go out ride my bike with my friends we're gonna have a good time well we found a cookout it took us all day but we found a cookout so that's my plan for today i hope you guys are having a great day a great prosperous day i hope those have those blessings started rolling in. i hope those blessings started rolling in okay so our read all day guys i was getting nagged by this divine masculine energy next so this morning i did my spread you know what i'm saying i used my as above below deck number two of deck number one i just just pulling the card for the day so the message that i got this morning there's a divine masculine in distress because he wants to tell you how he feels because he wants to come forward he wants to tell you how he feels he feels like he owes you an explanation or being sorry or something so i said you know what spirit I'm, i said you know this could just be low energy this morning i let it go I said, you know what I'm going to try to do? 1.31 o'clock, not do a video to see if this lingering energy. Remember, guys, I haven't drank in a week, so the downloads come faster. And this nagging ass divine, yeah, that's what I said. Nagging ass divine masculine energy wants me to get the message out so bad that he wants to talk to you, that he wants to talk to you, that he wants to tell you stuff. So, you know, I said, skr, I can take five minutes out of my day to do this video for you guys so if you are in separation with your divine masculine if this energy is energy if it resonates with this baby this is for you divine masculine wants to come forward and tell you something look at this king of wands and emperor energy look look at that look how the deck is already so i'm sure i'm so sure this is divine masculine and what he wants to tell you yeah divine masculine is watching you somebody's watching me i'm telling you this divine masculine is watching you so i don't know if he even on social media so i don't know if he directly watches you or somebody reviews and reports okay so somebody could be reviewing your page and reporting back to divine masculine but also i'm feeling but if there's any karmic person in this divine masculine's life there and you guys are in separation they are getting the brunt of the fact that he's upset that you guys are in separation like he's literally going around like upset and shit like mad at no divine message don't be mad at everybody else but yourself okay look at divine message energy want to come forward wanting to take you on a day wanting to go out with you look at this lovers and the aces aces words he always thinks about divine masculine i'm just gonna let these cards do their thing he's worried about facing judgment facing judgment for the things that he did to you for the way that he treated you for how he felt yeah look at knight of wands sexual energy too wanting to come forward so this is my message say damn not only did i mess up my connection with my twin flame soulmate energy i also mess up the fact that someone so i feel like this if you and this divine masculine were having like consistent sex or like you know what i'm saying you guys were kind of friends with benefits he's facing judgment for that too because i feel like spirit time ran out that the karmic's holding out on divine masculine because he has an attitude because you guys aren't together so so he's like in distress I, I i'm not kidding you guys i feel like when i keep thinking of this divine masculine energy three 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 on the clock baby he's like like picture someone sitting at a desk with lots of papers in it and someone just trying to keep going through the papers and keep going through papers and getting flustered and getting frustrated this is the energy from this divine masculine divine masculine for divine masculine energy feminine energy if it resonates resonates yeah and also this divine masculine I, he has an altar for sure lighting candles stay, try to stay pure so i feel like this divine masculine don't play games with me because i'm not you beg me to come and do this read and now i am and now you want me to tell them how you're pure fa facing judgment facing judgment for you yeah look at this tennis words working hard he's working hard this is why masculine shitting bricks right now because the fact look at he's so worried about coming forward and, and he's so worried about coming forward not so, spirit said coming forward but he's so worried about his repercussions also this is why masculine's so worried and think because you because he knows you're single so listen to this divine masculine any judgment knight of wands okay wanting to come in fast sexual energy knowing he left you in intense words energy knowing that you're rising above see the thing with this connection is divine masculine knows every time you guys go in separation or every time you guys get oh separation or whatever that you always rise above it okay it's working hard very hard spirits working you very leveling up mentally physically emotionally spiritually okay and saying oh my god she might come in she might find somebody else so divine masculine's freaking out that's why he's scattering 
four five six seven o'clock baby where he's scaring on the desk remember the person on the desk they're like oh my god my divine feminine oh my god sh you should worry okay if people look at eight of pentacles three of pentacles you can't tell me this my this my message knows that it's, he's in a twin flame soulmate relationship a hundred percent okay he's looked it up he looked it up he figured it out if you ever said anything to your divine masculine about a twin flame soulmate relationship he's looked it up so when he started looking it up what happened what spirit did was he started looking it up and spirit started sending him so oh my, i think that's my motorcycle friend. so um he started sending synchronicities they're, they're not picking me up though he started sending divine masculine synchronicities okay the more deep divine masculine got into it the more he started under, understanding spirituality the more he started understanding the connection i say this if people wanted to treat if people want you to talk good about them they will treat you the way they want you to talk good about them okay also when we say divine masculine surrendering okay so i just this karmic energy is like pissing me off too because i feel like the karmic thought so if you and divine masculine are in separation the karmic knows that she feels like she won something but at the end of the day, happy because Divine Masculine's not happy. See, that's what I'm saying. See, that's what I'm saying. But Divine Feminine, you know, ever at the end of the day, you know that you are the only person that's responsible for making you happy. You are the only person that you like, you don't, this Divine Feminine Masculine energy, they don't depend on other people to make them happy. They just like when people add happiness to their life. So I say this. If someone can't add happiness in your life, get them the fuck out. Just like that. Sorry for cussing and being so... Because, guys, when I get mad, I get big mad. That's a scorpion in me, but also, like, we have to realistically know, like, if somebody wants to... Look at wanting to come forward. This is why Masculine is not even letting me get this. Sentences out. If somebody wanted to treat you right and they wanted you to talk about them in good references, they would treat you exactly how the way they want you to talk about them. Okay? So, check out this. Three, three, three. This is why Masculine. Look at justice. <laughs> Divine, this divine masculine, he's manifest. Yeah, <laughs> divine masculine, so heavy on six twenty five, like on the manifestations. He's like hell no. I'm telling you, this is like somebody scurrying. He feels like he's running out of time. He feels look look at this with the two of wands manifesting the relationship strength card, obsessively thinking without the devil with the devil card. So not only that, divine masculine, he knows that you're so sweet. Okay, he knows that you're sweet. He knows that you're not salty. You. You can sneak in. You still mess up the energy. I don't care. Sneak out. I need Vaseline. Sneak out. Sorry, guys. My son calls himself sneaking in the room. Okay, so, and the overall energy for Divine Masculine, because Dex closed on this one. I seen Divine Masculine was in his lazy love energy. Look at this. Why is Divine Masculine upset? Because look at this energy. This is my Divine Feminine. This is all I ever wanted. 7.41 on the clock. That's being patient. She was patient for me. She was waiting for me the whole time. I did nothing but break her heart. I walked away from her. I put her in this energy. And this is my Empress. And now, like, I'm fucked. Screwed. Basically. Judgment. This goes on the judgment side. Worried. Divine Masculine. Look at this. Queen of Pentacles. King of Wands. Look at it. I'm sorry, Divine Feminine. You provide me with lots of love. You give me everything that I want, everything that I need. And I had the nerve to come forward to be karmic. Now, 808 on the clock. Ooh, like an 808. Now, look how many mountains, how hard. Look how hard it's going to be for me to come forward. Nastiness, lizardness. Divine Masculine literally like pushing karmics out the way. Like, no, I can't do pushing karmics out the way with the Navel Wands, Ten of Swords. I don't do this. And this karmic knows that Divine Masculine wants to come forward to you she knows okay so what she tried to do is everything she now now 8 34 on the clock now that you and divine masculine are not in contact now she's starting shit with divine masculine now she's starting shit with him because she knows she can sense it she can feel it eight of wands yeah with the death look at divine masculine is going to send you a text message look at this <clears throat> excuse me look at clear my throat chakra divine masculine needs to find it he's worried about not saying the exact things i need to say because he feels like he'll he'll call or text you and you will hang up that damn phone you damn right because you better come with the right words to say do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth so this is why masculine's worried he's manifesting connection the connection he's manifesting communication he wants to come in fast i'm telling you he's so worried about you being with someone else look at death card he said oh my god i think i ended my connection so that's why he started manifesting it because it was an end ice when i say this ending was ice cold it was an ice cold clean break so if you just ice cold clean broke from your divine masculine he's worried about that look at writing the text messages erasing it writing the dm erasing it sending a message to a friend could you check bro i'm not sure blah blah all this stuff you know why because this is his overall energy 9 39 o'clock for what he did to you for how he feels worried about judgment oh my god not only that worried about judgment look at this this is my masculine 
not only look at look at that where's that other card that because this is my masculine really, you're everything this is my masculine wants needs and desires okay not only does he want the family life with you but he wants to come and get married look at this sexual energy marriage you do you do, bitch can't do like me I, you can't listen divine feminine masculine energy energy resume if there's a karmic in this situation you are you completely complete your divine masculine sexually okay you light him off fire this girl is on fire yeah you complete his life you light him up he's so attracted to you the thought of you makes him attractive looking at your picture makes him attracted he can't do nothing listen sometimes if he has sex with a karmic or another person he pretends it's you if you don't know nine no since you got three 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 so look at chariot also if your birthday's coming up spirit also this morning spirit gave tell me divine mouth something with a birthday party so if it's your birthday today happy birthday but if your birthday's coming up in the next couple months the next couple weeks i feel like there's a divine masculine that's planning something for you okay i'm telling you he knows this is my masculine knows he has got to come correct or he cannot come at all i just look at this manifesting this connection okay so this divine masculine knows a little bit of magic or it's okay i'm saying he got a little crystals got a couple candles but divine masculine mind your thoughts when you're manifesting i'm proud of you actually if you really want your divine feminine and you really want to come forward to her 11 13 o'clock with transformation and balance and she's someone that you really want to be with i'm proud of you for manifesting her in the right way okay use a three six nine method um i'm proud of you for manifesting her in the right way i'm proud of you for working on yourself and i'm proud of you for wanting to come in and be a better man and be in this energy he decides in you baby come and give me something new so listen you might have had to end this cycle it might be for 666 years guys or it might be for six days six months six weeks you know what i'm saying how whatever works for you and divine masculine remember twin flame soul relationships are unlike any other they're different they're special okay so yeah five ones lots of defensive energy okay i got the star card in reverse i'm actually gonna take it like that and i got the high priestess card two in reverse divine masculine and two knows he fucked up you done fucked up you done fucked up uh, you the fuck that he knows it okay so defensive to other people because he's carrying a heavy burden of not being able to come forward to you he, if, if he only came forward and apologized because remember this read is because he has to tell you something so drastic and um he's like i feel false hopes and spirit is really guiding him towards you to talk to you told to nine o'clock look at candle magic i'm not knocking it to my mask and you know candle magic you do look at him in the karmic now 12 27 o'clock and the karma i keep picking up karmic energy like What's up with that? There's a karmic. The karmic is mad because divine masculine's in separation with you. I, the, it can't get any better than this. Sunshine got a three, three, three. I can't do not, guys. Look at it. Yeah. Because, and he's always thinking about you. The karmic will look at divine masculine and knows he's in deep thought about you, divine feminine. His true divine feminine. Not the fake one. Not balanced energy. Super unbalanced energy. Look at third party situations, whether you know or know or not. Okay. Tower card. Look at four pentacles holding back, saying, damn, I should have just came forward. Baby, come and give me something. Oh, look at this. With the King of Cups, the Hierophant, and the Emperor, and the Lovers, 13, no, 6, 7 o'clock, St. Divine Feminine. If I don't come forward, I'm going to lose it. Heartbreak energy in the moon. Divine Masculine is being guided by the moon. This Divine Masculine following the moon cycles, too. Also, any secrets that you think your Divine Masculine is holding back from, he's going to come forward and tell you. Also, if you like seafood, he's going to come forward and he's going to want to take you out for seafood or something like that. And so if you like lobster... He's going to want to take you out for seafood or something like that. 13, 13 o'clock. It just popped out. He's going to want to come forward. He, he wants to date you. He said, no, I'm going to come for a date. I'm sorry. I had many options, decision, un, unconventional, string along. Sorry for treating you like a one night stand, divine feminine, because honestly, I have a lot of passion for you. So I got a three, three, three. This is what he wanted me to say all day. Seduction. Since you was sexy, right? The Usher song, Seduction, he wants you to come in and seduce me, baby. He wants you to do that. He wants you to, he loves it. I'm telling you, Divine Feminine, you do it for him. You bring him stabilities, okay? Stability and security. Because this Divine Masculine knows loyalty is royalty, he knows that you're going to be, that you're loyal to him. That's like a big thing with these Divine Masculines. If they don't tell you, I do look at love. 14, 11 on the clock. So many things I got to tell you, but I'm afraid I don't know how. Cause there's a possibility that you look at me. Okay, so I got a three to three. I love you guys. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna pick the messages from Divine Masculine so I can get this energy out. And then I'm gonna go ride my bike. Happy Memorial Day. Okay, guys. Oh, Rosh Hashanah tomorrow, five, seven, eight, two. And I gotta show you guys something too. Okay, what do we got? I feel so lonely without you. I miss your smile. You have always felt so familiar to me. Spirit, could I have one more? 
These are things that my masculines want to tell you. I'm listening to my heart and soul more now. I do care about you so much. And I'm scared you won't accept the real me. Sunshine guy is three through three. Top of the deck. I'm sorry for taking advantage of you. Woo, but you can't do it like me. That karma gets pissed, girl. You guys have a great day, Sunshine Guy 323. I love you guys. New Moon and Virgo. Set your intentions tonight. Set your intentions. Clean your altars off. Expect the changes. Rechar we're recharging. We're renewing. We're accepting the new. We're taking that old energy out. Okay, we're ending those karmic cycle spirits that pick one of these cards right here. And choose wisely in your choice. Look at that number seven, guys. Seven, 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 baby. Sunshine Guy at 323. I love you guys. Keep your head for heart close, God. And I'll catch you on my midday mix or my next read. Whatever comes first. Mwah.